Master Importing Apparel from Bangladesh. Welcome back to our Customs Brokerage series, where we explore the ins and outs of importing various goods from different countries. In this episode, we'll be diving into the process of importing clothing and apparel from Bangladesh and the restrictions you should be aware of. So, let's get started. Understanding the basics importing goods from Bangladesh involves several key steps, especially when it comes to clothing and apparel. First and foremost, you need to have a solid understanding of customs brokerage and the necessary paperwork involved. Customs brokerage is a profession that helps facilitate the import and export of goods while ensuring compliance with various regulations. Customs bond and customs broker. When importing clothing and apparel from Bangladesh, it's crucial to have a customs bond in place. A customs bond is a financial guarantee that ensures you'll comply with all the customs regulations and pay any required fees or fines. It acts as an insurance policy to protect the government and your business interests. To make the importing process smooth and efficient, working with a customs broker is highly recommended. A customs broker is a licensed professional who specializes in navigating the complex customs clearance procedures. They will handle the paperwork, communicate with customs authorities, and ensure compliance with all regulations, including any restrictions related to clothing and apparel. Importer Security Filing ISF. Another important aspect to consider when importing clothing and apparel from Bangladesh is the Importer Security Filing ISF. The ISF is a requirement by the U.S. Customs and Border Protection CBP, for all ocean shipments entering the United States. It is a digital document that must be submitted to CBP at least 24 hours before the shipment is loaded onto the vessel. The ISF contains essential information about the goods being imported, including the shipper and consignee details, the port of loading, and a list of items included in the shipment. Failing to submit the ISF or providing inaccurate information can result in penalties and delays in customs clearance. Restrictions on clothing and apparel while importing clothing and apparel from Bangladesh, it's crucial to be aware of potential restrictions. These restrictions can include quotas, embargoes, trade agreements, and regulations specific to the textile industry. It's essential to stay updated with the latest regulations and restrictions to ensure a smooth importing process. Additionally, some clothing and apparel items may be subject to additional scrutiny due to intellectual property rights protection. Counterfeit goods and trademark infringement are serious concerns in the fashion industry, so customs authorities are vigilant in identifying and confiscating such items. Working with reliable suppliers. To minimize any potential issues or complications during the importing process, working with reliable suppliers in Bangladesh is crucial. Choose suppliers who have a good track record of compliance and are aware of the regulations and restrictions involved in importing clothing and apparel. This will help ensure that the products you import meet the necessary quality standards and are produced ethically. That wraps up our deep dive into importing clothing and apparel from Bangladesh and the restrictions you need to be aware of. Remember, having a customs bond and hiring a customs broker will make the importing process smoother and more efficient. Don't forget to submit the importer security filing ISF, on time and stay up to date with any regulations or restrictions. Thank you for watching, and be sure to tune in for our upcoming videos on various aspects of international trade. Disclaimer notification below.